maybe over here. I don't think it's down here near Kent. Horse right there. Yeah, we're just we're gonna go with that. That seems right. Oh, hi everyone. So today I will be playing GeoGuessr United Kingdom. However, you may have noticed by my strange accent that I am not from the UK. I am an American living in the USA. So I'm going to test my knowledge of the United Kingdom on GeoGuessr today. And I'm pretty sure my knowledge is decent, but not great. And also, I've never been there, although I'd definitely like to visit one day. I'm going to be shooting for 20,000 points this time around. Same as always, although I might not make it there. I mean, I'm going to try. If I get there, I'll be very happy with myself, but I might not. And again, me thinking that I might do well just might be the Dunning-Kruger effect. Also, I'm not sure whether or not this includes Northern Ireland or not, but I guess if I'm way off, I'll figure it out. So, without further ado, let's begin. GeoGuessr UK, round one, shooting for 20,000 points. Oh, shut up. I ain't paying you. Um, okay. So, oh, wait. Oh, no. Okay. My bad. Yeah, we want five minutes, like always. No. Right there, five minutes. Okay, single player, yep. Moving, panning, and zooming allowed, just like always. All right, let's do this. All right, some trees. Oh, it's lagging again. Okay, all right. So, this is interesting, so. We're in a hilly kind of region, not super hilly, but we might be in the southwest of England, I would think. Or maybe Wales, maybe Wales. But we'll keep moving along, see if we see anything. Oh, what does this sign say? I can't get in the right spot to see the sign. Again, the sign may very well say nothing of value. Uh, yeah, probably nothing. Okay. Let's keep going. I feel like, I mean, if I guess, like, somewhere around, um, yeah, I don't know. Welcome to Barn Farm. Is that the name of the farm? Is Barn Farm? That's a terrible name if that's the case <laughs> I mean I get that you know English is like the language of the place but you know you, you got to be more creative than that come on Jeez. again you probably you might not be able to hear it now but the fan is going right now the fan of my computer is going Stanton Okay, let's go down here. We have three minutes left. Yeah, this thing's going like crazy now. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know if we're in uh, England or Wales. Um. Hmm. No, okay, we're not all the way over there. Oh, no, nope, not there. May I mean, maybe there. I don't know. See, this is kind of a tough one, because... Yeah, again, I mean, even if this was like a U.S. thing, you know, again, I'm kind of in the middle of nowhere. Not, I mean, not, not truly, but, you know, again, there's just nothing around indicating, like, giving me a really good indication of where I'm at. I mean, I guess unless you're from the U.K. and it's incredibly obvious right now. Where you're just better at geography than me, which, you know, might be the case. Yeah, Stanton? I don't know. That kind of sounds like a... Um... It kind of seems like more like a... Kind of like... England kind of name. Like, Wales kind of has a more, um... Yeah, like, look, like, look at these names. Like, that's a... Kind of all over the place over there. Those, uh, Celtic words... But Stanton seems pretty straightforward. So we'll go with there. That seems reasonable enough to me. 
maybe we'll go a bit further north, like, like there. That's that seems about right. Maybe. I mean, I'll I'll look around a bit more just because I might be missing something incredibly obvious. I mean, there's hills here, which is typical of the west side of. Although, I mean, they're not like mountains or anything. There aren't very many, like, truly flat places in Britain, I don't think. And, yeah, I feel like there's too many trees for this to be the Salisbury Plain, so we'll go with, yeah, near Oxford, probably. So we'll go with this. Oh, okay. Huh. Alright. Not a terrible guess, so, actually, I should have guessed further north. Near the near the peak district, so I guess it was more mountainous than I would have originally thought. Because there's a couple large hills in the peak district, I'm pretty sure. I mean, it's called the peak district, but... So, yeah, I don't think I miss... Yeah, 84 miles away. Again, 84 miles on the US version would be amazing, but it only earned me 1,500 points. So, again, so I have to pretty much... So I have to do really well on the next couple of rounds to get to that um, 20,000. I might not... Oh god, what is this ad? No. <laughs> like, what the heck is going on here? Okay. Yeah, we'll just move on from that. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, why? Jeez, stop taking me on these country roads. I hope I don't do bad on, like, every single one of these. It's like, geez, I might lose, like, all my subscribers, you know? I don't want to do that. Okay, so it defi it's definitely flatter here, so... The flattest places are toward the uh, eastern side of the country. Of course, again, if 84 miles away gets you 1,500 points, then I need to be a lot closer than that. Road liable to flooding. Okay, so we are in a low area. How low is unknown at this point. But we are in a lower area. Oh dear. Did, did I get turned around right here? Or... Jeez, I don't know if it turned me around. Like, the way it went right there was just kind of weird. Like, did I get turned around? I don't know, I'll just go this way. So, did we leave the flooded area? Yeah. Okay, so we are going... Ah! No, don't do that. How do I get that off of here? Okay. There's, uh, houses right here. And this might give us a clue. Oh, stop. Yeah, I know that. As long as you don't crash, I'll be fine. Um, that dude has some major shingle damage to his, uh, roof right there. Presumably, these three, or, or four, is that a, no, that's not a guy. Hopefully they're trying to fix that, because that needs fixed. Um, yeah, I got nothing else to say about that. So, yeah, but they're not really giving me many clues to where they're at. I mean, the eastern side of England seems like the best guess, but I've got really no indication. What the heck? Oh, that's just a... That's just a... Weaver's Way. Yeah, that doesn't help me. Um, that's just a very, um... This is just very unfortunate, you know? Two not great locations. Although, again, I'm near people's houses, so there might be some indication. Maybe. Again, maybe. Uh, and yeah, now we're back in the middle of nowhere. Um, I mean, it's pretty flat, but not like super flat. Uh, it's, I mean, it's like, not like flat. And that's the thing too, it's like, it's more like agricultural land and not like natural grassland. So, uh, maybe over here? 
I don't think it's down here near Kent. It might be, but I don't know. This area just kind of seems secluded. It just kind of seems more like... This is uh, Norwich, which is the... Um, what is it? It's the seat of um, Norfolk County, and then south of that is Suffolk. Okay. This area right here is like the flattest part near this uh, bay right here, but I'm going to go with right here. It, seem, it seems like the right thing to do, but okay, let, let's just keep going. We have time. Oh boy. Um, does this give me any, any indication whatsoever? Um, no, all these houses are pretty much have the exact same design though, so. Uh, they're all brick houses, they're all interesting, there's all horse right there. Yeah, we're just, we're gonna go with that, that seems right. Oh! Oh, I was right! I was right about Norfolk. Awesome. 21 miles away. Okay, 3,700 points. Awesome. All right. So that was my, so that was a good guess for a pretty small amount of information. And also maybe it isn't the Dunning-Kruger effect that makes me think that I'm good at British geography. Maybe I actually, or, or maybe it's just beginner's luck. Who knows? We'll, we'll figure it out. Now, I don't think I can get to 20,000 at this point, but... I might get, you know, close. I could probably still get 15,000 at this point. So, yeah, I'll go with that. And before the uh, terrible ads pop up on the right side of the screen, let's start the next round. All right, there's a British flag, so I know I'm in the UK. So that kind of narrows down my options a little bit. There's four different colored... Uh, trash bins right here or as or actually as we would call them trash cans but y'all in Britain call them bins so there's that yeah so let's ignore the bins for a minute and let's take a look around here cuz yeah yeah we gotta go around this way how do we escape this all uh, Small neighborhood right here. Jeez, there's a bunch of dead ends. It's like, how did all these cars get in here? There's got to be a way out of here. Jeez, what the heck? I thought there was a way out. Okay. <laughs> it's like, how do you get out of here? Okay. Jeez. Okay. Let's zoom out a bit. Can't get out that way. Okay. Now we're here. How <laughs> do we get out of here? What the heck? This is a one way street, too. What the heck? Wait, this, yeah, that's just a loop, and that goes. How do you get out of here? That, that needs picked up right there. Jeez. Jeez, I've been scrolling for two minutes already. I can't find my way out of here. Okay, let's see what this van says. Probably nothing. Or maybe... Or it might. You know. Okay, well, it definitely says nothing there. Um, uh, doesn't provide a location. Uh, I guess not. Yeah, I gotta find my way out of here. Like, or maybe I could just... Skip the... Okay, no, that's not what I wanted to do. Okay, can I, like, get out of here now? <sighs> well, or that might have... That might just have been the right thing. <laughs> yeah, this is... So far, this is a surprise... You know, it's surprising that this is turning out to be the hardest, uh... Round yet. Ah, <laughs> oh, I can't move. 
Oh my goodness, no. Well, shoot. Okay, is there anything on these signs that allows me to figure out where I'm at? I, I could be anywhere. I could seriously be anywhere. I, I don't want to, like, do terrible on this round. Because it's like, I feel like, you know, I'm so close to figuring out, like, heck, this thing probably has written on it, like, where it is. Like, that's an emergency vehicle right there. Like, if that's an emergency vehicle, it probably has written on it where it is, but I can't move. Ah. <laughs> uh. Yeah, I can't move. Okay. We might have to go... Wait. How do I go back to the original spot? Okay. Now, let's take a look up, because I can't really get out of here quickly. Well, there's a building over there, but I don't know... Um... Jeez. Oh my goodness. See, my computer's just glitching out at this point. I, I do not know where this is. I have absolutely no clue. I simply don't know, because I just don't have any clues. Uh, we'll just guess south of England and hope that's correct. It probably won't be, but... Um, okay. Sorry, y'all gonna have to stare at this ad with me. Sorry. Two. One. How bad did I do? Very bad. <laughs> Glasgow. That was in Scotland. Oh my god. And shut up with the dumbass ads, I swear. Okay. Yeah. I... Again, now probably if you lived in Glasgow or, you know, were familiar with the city, you could probably have figured that out. Just because of the subtle clues, but I don't I don't know subtle clues. Yeah. That that's that's disappointing that I was so close to figuring it out, but yet couldn't. So that was sad. And yeah, let's just move on and try to forget that that ever happened and now we're in the middle of nowhere again. So thanks for that reward. Um yeah. No, I'm not even bo try. To, I'm not even gonna bother trying to read that sign, cause that's gonna be a waste of time. Uh, you know, I don't have. Um. Yeah. A lot more trees here, but I feel like there's just trees just surrounding the road at this point. Um, 30 kilometers per hour. Here's some more modern houses right here. Mm, there's some construction signs. Is there anything about the construction company? It's like, I have yet to see anything, like, you know, related to, like, where, like, a location actually is. Like, I have yet to see a sign that says this location or this location. It's kind of annoying. It's like, geez, I'm four rounds in, still nothing. Because I'm paranoid. Um, oh, there we go, finally. Wickford Margaretting Chelmsford. That's probably not how it's pronounced, but... So, Ferd. So that's gotta be... Okay, so that's like a Norse word is... Ford or something, isn't it? Like, yeah, I'm pretty sure, because... So it'd probably be up... Like, the... 
Well, that would be like eastern side, because that's where all the uh, Norse people were at. Or where they uh, invaded and stuff. So, probably up here, I would think. Wickford. Uh, I feel like I've heard of that. I mean, I don't know. I feel like I've kind of heard of Chelmsford before, but I can't be sure. I mean, I don't know where it is if I have heard of it. Um... Again, I have a good chance of being way off on this. Let, let's just go around a little bit more, because... What does that say, does it? Billericay? Yeah, I don't think... Yeah, it doesn't help me. I think, honestly, I'll just keep scrolling around over here trying to find it. Um, because there's... Yeah, there's nothing else I can do, just except keep looking. Gotta keep searching for the small British town. Okay, yeah, I'm on the other, I'm on the wrong side. Let's, let's head south a little bit. Again, it's weird just how. Again, it's like I feel like I'm like searching like too much. Like <laughs> I'm not used to the small size of this country. Boston. Um. Where is this place? Grimsby Hull Scunthorpe Um the, I don't know, I feel like these towns are like too small, maybe. Again, I don't know. Or I might just be scrolling right past them, who knows? Well I gotta make a guess, so we'll make a guess over here. <laughs> Again, I'm disappointed. But, again, ah, okay, yep, southeast side, way far away. Yes, this is not turning out well. See, you know, I'm kind of relying more on, like, you know, the landscape to, like, tell me where a place is rather than, you know, just, like, what I'm seeing kind of thing, so... Or just like the towns there, because I'm not familiar with small British towns, so, yeah. Like, you know, I want to see something like, uh, like, you know, county names or something like that, but, you know, I'm just not seeing anything like that, so. Yeah, last round, let's try to make this a good one, and try to end on a positive note, and shut up with the goddamn ads. Okay, alright. Alright, I have high hopes for this one. There's a, um, hamper. Oh, wait, don't tell me that this is just, like, a thing where I can't move. Okay, so, I'm thinking Salisbury Plain. Maybe. Again, I could be way off. Oh, wait, there's the ocean. Is that the ocean? Okay, well, that's a big hint in that case where we're at. Let's just, let's head toward the ocean, then. Okay, no, let's not head that way. Oh. Okay, well, there. I guess there's a large uh, seasonal variation in precipitation, so I guess we'll go with that. So that's a thing in this location. Ooh, nice house. Maybe. Can I move? Can you please let me move? Um. We might be southwest England. Oh, yeah, we could be in Scotland, honestly. I mean... Wales, Scotland, England. I mean, heck, we could we could maybe be in Northern Ireland. I can probably not. Oh, well, there's like a thing way out in the distance, but there's no way I'm getting to over there. And that needs cleaned up too. Jeez, what's with all like the trash and stuff? Y'all gotta fix that over there. All again, I guess they're all in private property, so I guess I guess, I guess carry on, you know, carry on with whatever you're doing. I don't care. People on bikes. Okay, what does this sign say? A 
couple of small towns that I have not heard of. St. Ives, Leland Downs, Mail. Oh, what the heck? I'm just trying to think of like names that I know that sounds similar to that because that might mean. Um. Wales? Like there's a St. Ives. Um, oh, we're just going to do this again, aren't we? St. David's. Again, it has saint in it. It's the word doesn't, I don't know. Isn't like saint like a Catholic thing? I'm pretty sure. Oh, yeah, it is. I'm pretty sure. So that means that there's like, there was historically Catholics in the area. Oh, wait, is that a palm tree right there? Hold up. This changes everything. But I can't... Okay, that doesn't look quite like a palm tree, but... It looks kind of like that. In that case, we might be in Cornwall then. Let's... Yeah, let's go and check out Cornwall. Say... Oh! Uh, okay, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go. Okay. St. Ives, where was Leland, Hale, where was the, I uh, can't remember all this, okay, go back to the signs, come on, alright, we can do this, we can do this, okay, <laughs> let's do this, let's, come on, let's finish off the strongest we've ever finished before, um, Net Caligra is very close, St. Ives and Leland Downs are both very close, Okay, so we're in Penderley? Maybe? Might be. Um, I... Oh. I think that's the mo... Oh. Don't reload. Do not. I swear, do not. Okay, we're, we're running out of time here. Alright. We're, go we're going, like, right here. We're not even really in a small town. We're just... Okay. Go with it. Ah! Ha ha! Alright, one small step for man, one giant leap for explorers of a faraway mysterious land known as Britain, United Kingdom of Great Britain and Northern Ireland. Why not try a few new maps? Exactly. Okay, I've never done this map before, and I've also, and again, I've never been to the UK. 4,906 points. I will take that. Awesome. I got a bronze medal. I got 10,717 points. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day or night, I don't care. And remember to never stop learning.